So I have done videos over the past, ooh, I've been on YouTube for a long, long time and though my subscribers may not show it's because I've been in grad school over the years and undergrad and got off of YouTube, came back, back and forth. So <laughs> I just want to say I've been on YouTube for years and in between the years I've been taking care of my hair, not taking care of my hair, taking care of my hair, not taking care of my hair. But yeah, today's video, you want to know whether or not I'm going natural. I had a couple of you asking me whether or not I was going natural or considering going natural, etc, etc. I feel like you can never know what you're going to do because I've said things and this is a whole part of journeys and growing. Is I could say one thing and then later on I could change my mind as you all have seen in the past. I literally was going natural. Um, and then decided, you know, months later that, you know, I wasn't like I went and did the process of the whole trying to transition and it was just too, 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 too much. Like my, my natural hair was too much for me. Um, and it wasn't the fact that I had issues with the deep, deep, deep markation. The, I don't know, whatever it's called, the, the difference between the, um, the relaxed hair and the uh, natural hair demarcation that's what it is <laughs> brain fart so it wasn't that it was just the fact that I really really did really love my hair it was wavy um, and then some arrows it was spiral so I noticed that in the front it, my curls are m much looser and then in the back it's, it's spirally but during that process I definitely was going natural I was over the relaxers um just even though i wasn't even doing it that often whether i went from once a year to twice a year to four times of the out of the year and i just was like over it and it wasn't because i was um just having burns or anything it's like the breakage that i was ha having and though i was causing a lot of the breakage because i wasn't drinking enough water or because i was not protecting my over or already relaxed hair i was just over it like but i learned that just because I go natural doesn't mean that I'm not going to have breakage either. And may I, though I may have less breakage if I'm natural or more, I don't know because again, I do not know the future. I'm going to be learning my new hair as I'm learning my relaxed hair. And with me learning whether what hair I want to be learning, I'm going to be on a journey. I'm going to be experiencing different things because I have to figure something new out. This whole relaxed thing to me, though I've had it for years, I'm fairly new to the hair journey aspect of it because I just was just doing my hair, not really paying attention to what products my hair loves and why my hair loves that, you know? So whether it being high porosity or low porosity, condition that has sulfates in it and a condition that does not have, it's like those are the many things that I'm learning on this journey. So as of now, right now, today, <laughs> I am not going natural. Um, I love my relaxed hair it's flourishing it's growing though i know that i can learn my natural hair as well but i really hey dolls enjoying the video so far stay tuned by subscribing to my channel as well as clicking the notification bell to be notified of all my many videos that i love to post make sure you also comment down below on any questions that you may have on any video now let's get back to the video right now in my life i don't want to do that only because i have so much hair and i'm not wanting to start over again i'm not wanting to jump on a whole nother journey i really want to learn as much as possible because i don't really think you'll fully learn your hair altogether. um maybe i don't know maybe i'm wrong but i really want to learn as much as i can with my relaxed hair i want to know it to the t exactly what my hair i get I know that okay I need protein and I need moisture on the days that I need them but I want to know from the tea what chemicals like what 
ingredient my hair loves out of like let's just say that I'm using an amla oil what exactly in the amla oil does my hair love so I'm going to get that detailed eventually in like you know my videos or even in my hair journey if you all want to watch that then you know let me know but I really want to understand my hair a lot more and to me it's a challenge and that's why I say for me I'm not willing to jump on a whole natural challenge just because one I'm not ready for that I I haven't even grasped the challenge that I'm really willing to to do it's not about segregating you know a person who wants to relax hair versus a natural hair I've never I never been that type of person I don't jump on any bandwagons I do my own thing I'm original that's just how I always ride I'm I'm not one that's going to be jumping on anything I don't care if someone who got 50 million thousand subscribers says oh let's do this I don't care about that I do what I want to do if I don't want to go natural then I'm not going to go natural if I don't want to continue to relax my hair then I'm not going to continue to relax my hair again it's our choice on what we want to do and I think now this year like the end of 2018 and now um the whole segregating between hair groups um is like kind of dying down it was a huge thing about people going natural people bashing other people who didn't want to go natural other people bashing other people about relaxing it was just crazy and like i said i stand up for whatever i want to do if a person wants to go natural then let that person do what they want to do that's their hair and their reasons as to why they want to get go natural same vice versa when it comes to relaxes if the person wants to be relaxed let them do what they do like why do we have to control everything in everybody's life when we're not even controlling the very things that are going on in our own life period I don't, I don't get it but it is what it is right now I am not going natural um but at the same time I may change my mind months down the line a month down the line whatever the case may be um, so just stay tuned for like again the hair journey It's always going to be a hair journey where regardless of me being relaxed or natural it's going to continue to be a hair journey but as of now I'm enjoying my relaxed hair. The struggles definitely for me, I would say is when I have to cut off my hair because I messed up on something, you know, not drinking enough water or, you know, whether it was putting my hair in certain types of protective styles and then me having breakage. Like those are the things that I really, 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 really kick myself for. And I remember doing a video and I cut my hair, it was like me realizing where my hair stopped at but then I realized in the back that my hair was just all types of different um length and I cried and people were like oh it's just hair will just grow back or oh this oh that or whatever whatever but you all have to realize that if you've been going to going through a journey for because I, I think at the time it was a year I had for a year been trying to protect my hair and probably even longer than that actually and to see that it was in vain, like that junk hurts. It's like almost going in, I don't know, just think of something that you're really pressing towards and then you think that you're there only to realize that you're not there. Like that's the part that just really, you know, hurt me. It wasn't, it wasn't just a hair. It was the fact that I felt like I failed. I feel like people, if they don't have the same interests that you have they they won't understand if they're not necessarily on your journey then they won't understand them people may have a roundabout of how people may feel or whatever and a lot of you are nice about it you're just saying oh you know grow back oh you know you don't have to cut that much oh whatever whatever and i really truly thank you all for that as to some people who are saying oh it's just hair i don't know what the girl's problem is like please go find someone's someone else's page to go troll on or do whatever you just just don't get on nobody's page actually just get off YouTube period how about that <laughs> but uh I'm done y'all I'm done rambling I just want to come through just let y'all know about my hair um if y'all have any questions make sure you all subscribe um like the video comment down below and then also turn on your notifications because at the end of the day YouTube will not let you all know what's going on what videos I've posted unless you are updated by clicking the notification bell if there's any questions at all that you have, any ideas on different videos you would like to see on my channel, make sure you comment down below because I am answering you all's questions and I'm shooting these videos out. So without further ado, y'all, I am getting out of here. I love you all so much. I'll see you all later. Bye.